Taylor Swift and Beyonce's success highlights the business of music. In the ever-evolving landscape of the music industry, artists like Taylor Swift and Beyonce are making headlines not only for their chart-topping hits, but also for their strategic business moves that prioritize profits over traditional notions of serious journalism. Taylor Swift, known for her storytelling through music, has not only maintained her reign as a pop sensation, but has also ventured into the world of re-releasing her earlier albums. This move, often referred to as re-recordings, allows her to regain control of her music catalog and generate substantial income. Swift's decision to re-record her albums stems from her dispute with the ownership of her master recordings. By reclaiming her work, she not only secures her artistic legacy but also capitalizes on her own success. On the other hand, Beyoncé, a global icon in her own right, has been at the forefront of the music industry's shift towards visual albums and surprise releases. Beyoncé's ability to drop an album without prior promotion or singles has become a trademark move, disrupting the traditional rollout of music. This unconventional approach generates buzz, social media frenzy, and immediate sales. It's a testament to her immense popularity and her understanding of how to harness the digital age to maximize profits. Both Swift and Beyoncé's strategic decisions in the music industry underscore the changing nature of music consumption. In today's digital era, artists must adapt to new revenue streams beyond just album sales and live performances. They must consider brand endorsements, streaming royalties, and merchandise sales to thrive financially. Critics argue that these strategies place profit above the artistry and depth of music. They claim that artists should prioritize creating meaningful and culturally relevant content over chasing profits. However, it's essential to recognize that the music industry has always been a business. Artists have bills to pay, teams to support, and ambitions to fulfill. In this context, Taylor Swift and Beyoncé are merely adapting to the industry's evolving landscape. It's worth noting that these artists are not alone in pursuing profitable ventures. Many musicians are diversifying their income streams, collaborating with brands, and exploring non-traditional avenues such as NFTs, non-fungible tokens, to monetize their art. In conclusion, Taylor Swift and Beyoncé's business-oriented strategies in the music industry reflect the changing dynamics of music consumption and revenue generation. While they may seem to prioritize profits over traditional journalism, they are simply navigating the modern music landscape, where adaptability and financial sustainability are crucial for long-term success. These artists continue to create impactful music while also being shrewd entrepreneurs in an industry that demands versatility and innovation.